What's up guys? I'm out here walking in the park uh, back to Idaho Falls from Nashville. Feeling super pumped up today. I got my day, uh, what is it? Day number nine of Body Beast and I'm ready to crush that workout. Um, one day behind them, build chest and try. So I'm stoked to be able to do that workout. Stoked to be able to drink my tropical shakeology this morning and get uh, start getting back into routine. Um, got back late last night, had to obviously, most importantly, spend time with the kids and the family. Uh, they come first always, so give them some time. And then today I want to kind of get back into my routine. And to be honest, I woke up and I was overwhelmed a little bit. What's going on, Rich? Good to see you, brother. Uh, but I was feeling overwhelmed this morning because uh, so much emotion and passion being around 25,000 coaches. And I spoke uh, to about 500 people on Thursday morning at a team event. And then Friday, I spoke in a workshop of 7,000 people. And Saturday, in a workshop of 7,000. So being an introvert, like I am exhausted. Um, and, you know, a lot of people come up and they want to take a picture and say hi. And, and I love that. It feels good to know that I've helped so many people in, in some way or another through one of my messages. And so as I um, uh, come out of that, I'm tired. I'm exhausted. I kind of need to emotionally recharge. But also the team needs us, right? We need to be up and, and taking action on what we learned and getting uh, back into the routine of things. So I got up and I was like, you know, I have texts and I have over 100 Facebook messages saying, hey, I'm back from Summit, I'm excited, I need to get on the phone and talk, um, set up some plans and some goals, and, and I'm going to get to all those, and I'm, I've been working through it and, and whatnot, but I, that can feel overwhelming, right, to have like that much on your plate. Uh, but what I want you guys to know what I do is, guys, I just take it slow, one day at a time, and just realize that you can do the best that you can absolutely do every single day and to stay focused on, on what matters most and to take care of yourself first and foremost. So I did my miracle morning, I read, I'm doing my workout right now, and then you just do one thing at a time and realize that you don't have to do everything right now. I want you guys to understand that, that it takes, that you can schedule things and, and plan things out and then you'll have less anxiety. So as, as people are needing help, um, you know, what I do is I just schedule. I just schedule calls, plan out my time, and then I can help you know, each of them one at a time. But First and foremost, it's so easy to get into the trap of, and I want you guys to understand this, of just jumping in and trying to do everything, 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 and then you don't take care of yourself and you'll never last if you do that. So, um, did my personal development. I did my, uh, doing my workout here in like five minutes, and my dad's about here. Uh, I was listening to personal development in my truck right here, working from the park, because I love the outdoors. And I left my key on when I rolled my dang window down, so my, um, so my truck died <laughs> when I tried to get up and leave to go do my workout. So that shows you where I'm at. Um, so my dad's coming to save the day right now. So there's right there, there's Super Dad coming to help me <laughs> get my uh, jump my truck so I can get back home to do my workout. But um, that's what <clears throat> that's why I just wanted you guys to know is uh, when you feel overwhelmed, if you're a beach body coach or you're working on some kind of goal, when you feel overwhelmed or or you know any of those feelings of I got too much to do this is you know a lot of times it's easy to get on overload sensory and do nothing I was calling there so when you get to that point uh, where you feel like that overwhelmed with all the things that you need to do remember to focus on the basics and we have put it together so simply with the team and with Beachbody that we have the four vital behaviors so first and foremost when you're overwhelmed commit to your commitments Remember, decide, commit, succeed. Not decide, commit, quit when it gets hard or frustrating or overwhelming. Decide, commit, succeed. So that's what I want you guys to remember. So um, do the four vital behaviors, which is what I, I did this morning. And now I feel good because I know that I've done what I can take care of. And then I just do the best I can to help everybody at the pace that I can. So do your work, do your personal development. Do your workout. Um, start five, three to five new conversations. Invite people. Uh, to join this journey with you and then celebrate some people's success. So that's what I did. And then one, just realize that you're not, nobody is Superman. You can't do everything. You can just do uh, the best that you can. And, and that's all that you need to be. So hope this helps you guys this morning. If you're feeling overwhelmed um, coming out of Summit, stay focused on your goals, visualize them, read your personal development, do your workout, drink your Shakeology, post on social media, and invite people. And then just do the best you can to do everything else. So I love you guys. Hope this helps you guys out. And uh, we'll be seeing you guys next time.